All right, Trent, your senior year. Uh, what's what's kind of going through your mind early in this camp? One that is starting to come to an end, that I'm glad to be a part of this team, that we're actually really pushing and molding together as a unit, and it's going to be very interesting to see how we do that first kickoff against Ole Miss. Being a fifth-year guy, you've progressed a lot since you're, when you first stepped on this campus. Just kind of talk about what it's like taking over a leadership role now. It was a grind coming to where I was right now, and I'm glad to be a leader on this team. Uh, it's just fun to see how these young guys, they start to come into their roles, they start to understand, and it's great to just be a leader for them and help them to find their little niche, as you can say, on the team. Just being able to kind of talk about being able to be the number one guy, but also being able to mentor the guys behind you to just keep this thing running, because you can't do it all by yourself. Yeah. Uh, yeah, we have a bunch of great backs, and one, I, I use them more than I would say they I, that they actually use me, mm -hmm. just because, yeah, I'll teach them what to do and how to run, because I've been there, I've done that, but I, I like how they push me, and they continually make me better. That way I can help this team as much as I can. And you see some talent behind you, so it makes you have to step yeah, up your game. Of talent behind us. I mean, you got LD, he's starting to come back from his injuries that he's had over the years. He's looking great out there. Jamie runs hard, and we just added Preston from Juco, and he's been showing out here the last couple of days. So. And we've kind of been talking a little bit about how, uh, you know, there may not be as many stars that national media may know, but this team's probably just as deep or deeper everywhere in, in yeah. a lot of positions. I mean, we got a bunch of blue-collar players out here. I mean, we don't have anybody just flashy that's going to be that third, fourth draft pick or anything. But we have a bunch of hard workers, and that's what's going to help us throughout the season to win games. I mean, practice is going well right now. Each day we're coming out here to get better, definitely with the offensive line. Uh, we got a lot of guys that's, uh, that need to come along, and they've been working hard every day to come along, and uh, we're just working to get better each and every day. This is your, your redshirt junior, but now you're the center. You're the kind of pillar of that offensive line. Talk about being around a, a group of guys that are a little less experienced than uh, you know years in the past. Well, you know, over the last year we had a couple guys that were like four-year starters, like you know Charles Sweet, Matt Axline, and all them, and. Uh, this year, we got guys that are coming along that are stepping up. Uh, we got guys that have playing, uh, playing experience, like uh, Kaderen Bond, you know, he played some last year. Robert Burley Jackson started uh, about a year ago. So you got some guys that have some ex some playing experience, and you got a, guy, a lot of guys that really don't. But they're, you know, they're working hard each day. I know right now you guys are starting to kind of get your glue, and Coach talked about how the offense was there and making some big plays. So just kind of talk about how, how things are starting to click. Well, offensive line starting to come together. The whole offense is starting to come together now. And uh, after, you know, after these couple practices, you know, we're starting to finally gel and mesh. So, you know, once that happens, everybody starts, you know, working hard, coming together, fighting for one another, and, uh, you know, we get success.